It's a victory celebration Ryan Miley's waited almost a decade for. On Thursday night, he took 54% of the vote to win the seat in Saskatoon, Miwasan, giving the NDP 11 seats in opposition. Feeling very excited, feeling very honoured, and feeling like this is something quite big in the province. Not because I've been elected, but because people have chosen to send this message. Message that this government is past its best before date and that they want to see things done better. Miley is no stranger to Saskatchewan politics. He twice ran for party leader, first in 2009 and then in 2013, finishing second both times. The men that defeated Miley, Dwayne Ligenfelter and Cam Broton, both lost their seats in their first election after becoming leader. Ironically, the man who finished third in 2013, Trent Watherspoon, is the interim leader of the official opposition. This is somebody who's uh, frankly served uh, uh, his community and our province his entire life. Somebody who's uh, fought for uh, uh, people and will come in uh, hitting the ground running with our, our team of strong leaders um, and uh, be ready to, uh, ready to help us build and very importantly to help us fight for Saskatchewan people. Last year, Watherspoon took his name out of the running to be permanent leader of the NDP, the party has its leadership convention scheduled for May 2018. And if Ryan Miley is interested, as the Premier and others suggest, he'll have a few months to audition here at the legislature. But he doesn't have much time to get ready for his new job. He'll be sworn in on Monday afternoon, right before question period. Adam Hunter, CBC News, Regina.